Jersey last season, was second in the Novice Championship. Uh, have you had a nice winter? Yeah, I've had a great winter. Uh, I haven't done much riding. I've been doing, uh, been watching a little bit of motocross. Uh, been to a supercross track in Sheffield. Uh, this is my first time out on the supermoto this year, yeah. so hopefully uh, everything feels good. Uh, and I'm looking forward to this season. Yeah, I feel it's the same for a lot of people. This is the first time out this year on the Supermoto bikes. Uh, there's not always a lot of opportunities to get out, but it's good that Supermoto UK have organised these track days for Three Sisters. Um, so, yeah, the bike's feeling good. You're feeling yeah, good? I'm feeling good. Bike's feeling good. Uh, a couple of little problems with tyre pressure, I think, earlier on. I've got tyre pressure wrong because uh, it's a slightly colder day today and, and the track's colder. So I'm still learning uh, and I'm... I'm getting there, Daniel. I'm yeah. looking forward to it. But this is a great track here, and yeah. I, I really enjoy it. I think the first meetings here, am I right or wrong, is yeah, the first, first meeting. and the warm-up round. And the warm-up round. Warm-up round. Warm round in March, and then first meeting in April. But, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it, Daniel. You, are you? Yeah, I am. I am are looking you? forward to it. Well, you're riding OK. I've just followed yeah. you for a couple of laps. Yeah, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Still getting used to the bike again. It's been yeah. a while. I haven't ridden since November. Um, but, yeah, I'm really looking forward to Did it. Did you have some bit. problems with your knee last year? I've still got problems with my knee. Any good? So, uh, I've actually got my date for my surgery now. Oh, fantastic. So, I'm actually really looking forward to getting that all done and out of the way. The bike's now spot on. Found out we had quite a few issues with it last season. Um, but they're now all gone. Yeah. It's all sorted now, yeah, so I'm really looking forward to it. Good stuff. Well, nice to speak to you. Yeah, you too. See you soon. Have good luck. This is the tabletop section of Three Sisters. Normally we come down from the dirt, so it's a left-hand turn out of the dirt. And this is the run up to the tabletop of Three Sisters. So it's quite important because you're hitting this tabletop in maybe second or third gear. So you're going quite fast up into the upslope. So it's really important to sort of compress your speed as you hit the face of the jump. So rather than over jump it, and running past the downslope, you sort of come into the tabletop and use your body to compress onto the face of the jump. And that helps you just scrub the speed into the face of the jump and then land on the downslope and able to power through down to the right hand turn. This is also on a slight right hand turn, so it lends itself to be able to sort of turn the bike and keep it low and keep it like your center of gravity really low and keep your speed right across the face of the jump. So that's pretty much it. Um, but it was only set up for motocross really so um, I decided to sell my dirt bike and my other supermoto and get the new FS 450. So oh, great. first day here on the FS. Oh so what made you decide to have a go at a uh, supermoto and I think you're going to try racing this year aren't you? Yeah um, so it started off with track days um, with some of the lads from the island and um, I got to know a few more of you as they've come along and all of the girls I've met that do supermoto are saying get, get in do supermoto <laughs> it's really good don't feel like you can't come so I've just been trying to get some more seat time doing some more track days and yeah. stuff and then gonna come along give it a go oh that's really good to hear so you've gone and got yourself an FS450 so yeah. it's pretty much the bike for the job isn't it really that's it I wanted um, something you know I've, I've had bikes that I've had to take apart in my shed and build everything from scratch myself have my friends make up little 
things to make them fit on the spindle and this one's just straight out the factory ready to go so it's just what I needed. So. Yeah they're great and they're great for building confidence you know the yeah. bike's sort of ready to do what you need to do. Yeah. Um, so are you enjoying the track? Yeah really enjoy it. Every time I've been here I think that jump looks really big and then I get up to it and think oh my god it looks even bigger. <laughs> And, uh, I've done a couple of all right jumps over it today, but um, I'm guessing that will come with time. It's not well, like you guys. you confidence and yeah. just enjoying it. I think that's the best. And yeah. I think there's no one that's racing past you or making you feel uncomfortable as no. long as you're just enjoying it. I yeah. think that's the best. Yeah, everyone's really helpful. I mean, this morning um, the generator wouldn't start <laughs> and I couldn't get the tyre warmers on, obviously, because that wasn't starting. And we got the tyre warmers on, got the generator issue fixed, and then the bikes wouldn't start. So it's really nice, there's some guys nearby, everyone ran around and got us a battery charger. We had our own pit crew for a minute, getting the bikes up together and we got it going. So, oh, well, I'm really yeah. glad you got out and I'm glad you're enjoying yeah. yourself. Yeah, so. thank you, Thanks. thank you. See you on track. Jay, so we're at Three Sisters today. My fellow teammate, member of the Goon Squad. And been whinging that your bike's too old and too slow, and I've read it this morning, and I think you've <laughs> How are you finding it today? Um, plenty of excuses, really. <laughs> um, weather, we're lucky it's dry, aren't we? Yeah. It's dry out there, we're having fun, and can't thank the guys enough for putting on another good day here at Three Sisters. You're looking forward to the race season, mate? Yeah, can't wait. Yeah, can't wait. Really looking forward to the first round. Um, obviously, we've got the warm-up round in March as well, so should be good to get everyone out on the bikes. Yeah. Um, a repeat of last season, really. Oh, I'm really looking forward yeah. to this year. I mean, yeah. the old team set up and that should be good this yeah. year. Yeah, change we've up got, to the We've got a bit factory looking, hopefully. We've got a bit of backing, haven't we? Yeah, um, yeah, we've got some help, um, which obviously is a massive, massive help because we know we're not very um, professional and we're not very fast, but we do what we can to help people coming into the sport and that sort of stuff. So we want to get more people in the paddock, get a busier paddock. Yeah, and help each other out and Closer that. racing for us. So, yeah. yeah. So you're going to be riding this all season or are you going to be riding the Husky as well? Um, up for debate. I've got to ask a nice man if I can use his bike for a few <laughs> rounds here and there, but I'd like to use the Husky. It's um, oh, yeah, really oh, easier bike to ride, but yeah, like, this yeah. is... This is a 2003 Honda, yeah. and it's probably one of the oldest bikes in the paddock, if not... I think it is the oldest bike, yeah. really. Um, and it goes really well. I've rode it this morning. again, that shows people oh. getting into the sport. You don't have to spend 10 grand, 8 grand on a bike. There's a lot of stuff out there that can be semi-converted just to get your, your toe in, really. Yeah. Um, it's looked after me, but obviously the cost to replace it is um, quite high, so, yeah. It's like I started on an old bike and then went, oh, I'm getting more competitive now. I want to get on a quicker bike. And they are easier to ride. The newer bikes are a lot easier to ride. Yeah, definitely. Quickly, Electric but... starts are a godsend because yeah. I keep yeah. stalling it. And then... Um... You had a pro few problems with stalling the last season, didn't you? Yes, yeah. You lost, you lost, I think you was leading a racing crowd for quite a while. And yeah, then got a bit excited. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, let it go to me head, get a bit nervous <laughs> and uh, throw it down the drain. But 
hopefully this season we can get on the bike a bit before and yeah. also I got myself a little pit bike over the winter um, just to get on tracks really yeah, um, yeah. so many tracks will let us on cheaply um, and it's got to be transferable skills yeah cornering oh, speed yeah. that sort of stuff it's just bike time bike time's valuable Definitely. isn't it fitness is a big thing which obviously we don't <laughs> we don't we take seriously, too seriously that. But, yeah. Yeah. we need to we, both of us we're yeah. both on the same page we need to get a bit fitter for yeah. this season and it's not about being more competitive, it's about enjoying it more. Yeah, you're definitely. less tired, you're enjoying it more, won't we? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. Can't wait. No, me too, bud. Spawn. Thank you.